Hey YouTube, this is Drew Adam Tech here to show you how to encrypt your home folder on Ubuntu. So why do you want to do this? Maybe you've adopted Ubuntu as your main operating system and you are keeping confidential files on your computer. In fact, I would actually recommend doing this for all users because in today's world, we all have something to hide. Even if you don't think you have anything to hide, you do. But without further ado, let's get right into it. So first of all, we're going to want to go to Settings, Details, Users, click Unlock, and your password, and hit Enter, then hit Add User, and then make it an administrator, then and you're just going to fill out the information to add a user. For the purpose of this video, I'm just going to make it encryption. Encryption username is good. And then just allow user to set a password. Because I'll go on and then hit add. Or you can set a password right there. Okay. What you're going to do is close out of settings. And then you're going to log out. Then you're going to log, log into your new user. I'm going to make the password encryption. Just like that. <clears throat> yeah, and like this is just a temporary user. So if you're using like a user that you want for long term use, it should really be a sec more secure password. Okay, then just go through this setup. No, don't send system info. Next, done. Okay, then what you want to do is go to show applications. <coughs> and then you're gonna, you're gonna want to open up terminal. And once you open up terminal, you're gonna type sudo apt get install ecrypt fs utils crypt setup of that command in the description enter your password and hit y I'm going to install encrypt fs Once CryptFS is done installing, you're going to type sudo ecryptfs migrate home dash u drew. So you type sudo ecryptfs migrate home dash u, then your username. Hit enter. Okay, then you're going to type in your login passphrase, and it's very important that you get this right on the first try. Also, I have this command in the description. If you mess up, then and it'll use the wrong password to encrypt your home folder. So type it slowly if you have to. I'll be back after I type it. Okay, then I'll go through and encrypt your home folder. There you go. Then you can close out a terminal. then log out of that user, <coughs> then log back into your, your user. Very important that you do this before even rebooting your system. And once you've done that, first what you're going to want to do is if you just set this that extra user up as a temporary user just for this process, you're going to click on the user, click unlock, type in your password. Okay, then click remove user. You can go and delete their files. Okay, then close out of settings. Then you're going to want to open up terminal and type 
sudo not ls then type in your password okay then you're going to want to go to file system root then you're going to go to home and then delete this extra copy of your home folder it's like had just like random letters and numbers don't touch this one as the home symbol on it touch the one with like only delete the one without the home symbol bull like that has your username and then random letters and numbers okay so you've done that you're gonna want to right click on it then click move to trash there you go okay. and then just don't worry about this also huge disclaimer if you forget your password and you do not have an unencrypted backup of your home folder, then it will be impossible to recover your files. So keep that in mind. Here you go. You've successfully encrypted your home folder. Now have all your files secret from the world. So thanks for watching. If you liked this video, found it was helpful, hit the like button, share this video with your friends, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment.